Okay, now we're going to check to see if there's a significant difference between the age detection and which hospital they go to. Okay, so this is a one-way between group ANOVA. Let's check to see if age detection is in fact normal. We're going to go to Analyze, Descriptives, Explore. And remember, the three assumptions for running an ANOVA is normality of the data, homogeneity of variance between the groups, which means that the variance between each little subgroup is basically the same, and independence of observation, which we really can't say anything, so we just say it is assumed. So age is the DV. And again, we only check the DV for normality. Histogram, normality plots, click continue, click OK. So there's the descriptives. This is the test we're going to look at, the test for normality. And it violates the assumption. Okay, that is not a normal data set. So strike one. But now let's go ahead and run the assumption. We're going to go to, I'm sorry, run the ANOVA. Go to Analyze, General Linear Model, Univariate. And our DV again was age of detection and hospital. Um, we should probably plot the means. Add. Let's not worry about the post hoc test. So under the options, we want overall. We want the homogeneity test, descriptives, effect size, power, like always. Click code and continue. And that should be good enough for now. All right, so here's your output, 77 in A, 49 in B, 70 in C. There's their means. I'm looking at the means. They look pretty close, right? I got a high of 27.78 and a low of 23. That's only a difference of four, and the standard deviation is huge. So remember, your means have to be right around two standard deviations away from each other. So if you subtracted the the smallest from the largest, and divided that difference by the standard deviation. If that quotient is greater than 2, then you're going to have a significant difference between the two. Remember that. All right, here's the Levine's test. Remember, this checks for the assumption of homogeneity of variance. Did not violate, but it did violate normality. I think we're going to run a, um, a non-parametric test just to make sure after we do this. But here's your money box. Right here, this this number, significance value, and it's a F score. The F is very small, right? Remember, you need an F at least three before you can get a significant difference. And the significance value is not less than 0.05. Therefore, you do not reject the null hypothesis. You retain the null hypothesis, which, which states basically there's no significant difference between the hospitals when it comes to age of detection. Just to be on the safe side, since it violated the assumption of normality, I'm going to run the twin, non-parametric twin test of the ANOVA. We're going to go to Analyze Non-Parametric Tests, and these were independent samples. Automatically. So our test field was age of detection. And our grouping variable was hospital. Okay, we're going to run it. We should probably get the same result where you do not reject the null, right? Retain the null hypothesis. So that's it. There was no significant difference between the hospitals. MGZ, out.